In the fascinating world of architecture, there are encounters that can touch our inner selves, where light and space become magical elements that awaken emotions and create transformative experiences. Located on a small plot of approximately 13 feet wide by 33 feet deep, it was necessary not only to resolve lighting and ventilation through the ceiling, but also to use space very efficiently to avoid waste. It is within this context that HW Studio designed Casa Emma. Right at the entrance, we find an open space that houses the living room, dining room, and kitchen, with no space-consuming divisions between them. The principals of HW Studio had heard a lot about the Paul Arrego Museum, designed by Eduardo Suto de Mora, and had the opportunity to visit it a few years ago. Upon entering the museum, they were immediately moved. Beneath one of the pyramids, they were enveloped by a sense of awe and indescribable serenity. Light gently filtered through a high skylight, cascading like golden rays on the museum's surfaces. It felt as if every corner of the building was bathed in soft, velvety, warm light that touched everything and brought the space to life. The way the light descended from those ceilings was calming, creating shadows and reflections that danced across the walls and floors. The visitors immediately felt embraced and protected. Here, that same sense of serenity and calm is conveyed through light. Careful consideration was given to capturing the dynamic patterns of descending light over time, creating an immersive experience that aims to touch those who enter the house, just as they were touched. However, unlike Eduardo's museum, this house was conceived as an excavation exercise, carving out a void in the shape of a Purepecha granary called Troja, for which Emma felt a special fondness and attachment. For this reason, the interior is entirely made of wood, aiming to accentuate this concept and evoke those traditional constructions even more with a sense of respect and continuity while also conveying the same feeling of serenity and calm through light that the architects experienced that day. At the back, the refrigerator is concealed and the utility and storage area is located, along with the staircase leading to the mezzanine level bedroom above. This space is significant in terms of design, as it is the only element with a different materiality, a white volume that floats within the house. The choice of a different material aims to diminish its presence or make it appear lighter, as if it were a piece of cotton floating in space. To achieve this effect, it was essential for the light to diffuse its boundaries through reflection.
Casa Emma provides an experience that awakens emotions and invites contemplation. It is an invitation to immerse oneself in a world where light becomes the language of emotions and connection with oneself, a space that pays homage to the beauty of light.